Hello, hello, hello. Welcome or welcome back to the Creatives Unmuted Mic Tap Voice Ready, where creatives' voices are actually heard and our messages are fully expressed to the highest unleashing of our creativity. (laughs) And today, I want to continue the topic of how to get started as an artist, but with more actionable steps that you can use to cultivate creativity in your everyday life. Hello, my name is Rowena and I'm your host. I am an abstract artist, creative consultant, and entrepreneur. And through exploring the topic of cultivating creativity in your everyday life, you must first start by embracing a more creative mindset. You're able to unlock the power of adapting creativity into your life because the way you do one thing in life is the way you do it in other areas of your life. So when you begin to cultivate this creative mindset and creative habits, this will transfer into the way you do your your job or whatever you do for your career. You'll have that creative spark and be able to solve problems in the drop of a dime. I've been able to experience this myself being able to create content and go to school and actually use my creativity a lot more and solve problems i'm able to see how this translates from one area to life to the next the next point also is you're able to come up with more innovative ideas quicker so you're able to solve problems and allow your creativity to take a different avenue when it comes to innovation. Next, for point number two, cultivating and nurturing your creative habits. So in order for you to be more creative and foster true creativity, whatever that looks like for you, you want to be able to walk in nature a lot more, connect to nature in different ways, whether that's going to the beach or taking walks or just going and sitting in the park for a little while. You want to be able to nurture your connection with nature to allow the innate uh, innate artist within yourself to speak through clearly. And lastly, you want to be able to see the extraordinary in the ordinary. And I have the perfect example for this. (laughs) I thought about a trip that I took to Cincinnati and I was just walking around marveled by life because they have so many beautiful murals throughout the city and just so much historical architecture and just so much history to be stored and it was just a new novel of life that I was able to tap into and I stopped and took so many pictures I took pictures here took pictures there I even stopped at this revolving door that was just so beautiful and uh, the group that I was with I was like oh my gosh look at this door and <laughs> and everyone just looked like, what in the world is going on? <laughs> and when you're able to tap into that innate, uh, what is it? That innate creativity of life and find that extraordinary in the ex- like in the ordinary, just a simple door. A revolving door that has been there for years that people probably pass by and just think of it as a door and when I saw it I was like whoa what a relic what a piece of history that tells such an intricate story from the top of the door all the way to the bottom so use that example to unleash creative potential in the ordinary things in life, whether that be your home or the clothes you wear or the car you drive or the art that you create, allow that novelty to shine through and create innovative sparks 
for your mindset and allow it to ignite the inner fire within your inner artist. Again, you know me, Rowena, the host of The Creatives Unmuted. Thank you so much for tuning in. I will see you in the next one. I thank you, I love you, and I bless you. The next time, we will talk about overcoming artist block or creatives block, whatever you call it, and allowing it to be a catalyst for your next creative masterpieces. I'll catch you in the next one. Thank you.